Okay, this is kind of mental. At the end of the last Reddit video, I saw this post, informing me that some of my old Jack Sucks at Espanol videos were actually doing well for the first time. Because if you don't know, over a year ago, I made a channel called Jack Sucks at Espanol, where it's just my regular videos, but they're dubbed into Spanish. However, this channel did absolutely terribly. It got no Spanish-speaking viewers, and about four months ago, I abandoned it because I was just sick of losing money. However, when I saw this post last week, I went to investigate. When I found the password and logged in for the first time in months, I saw this. Keep it up, your channel got 1,199% more views than usual in the last 28 days. For some reason, even though I had uploaded no videos, I was getting good views, I was actually getting good watch time for the first time ever, I was even gaining subscribers from authentic Spanish-speaking countries. And I even had the opportunity to actually earn some money on this channel for the first time, seeing as so far I've just lost thousands and thousands of dollars, so how much money have I earned? 11 pence. <laughs> Basically, the monetization was turned off on the channel uh, when I switched networks at the start of the year and I didn't realize because I didn't log into the channel. So it was my first opportunity to make money and I made nothing. <laughs> However, the story doesn't end there. In fact, it gets even more exciting. The same day I managed to get the network monetized again, so at least it meant that from now on, any future views, I might actually earn some money. Thank God I did, because right after I monetized the channel, this happened. <laughs> So this little molehill that you can see here, this is the influx of views that I randomly got last month. You can see it died out a little bit. I thought that was a lot, but it is nothing compared to this. What on earth is going on? Yesterday, the channel had 500,000 views. Most of them are coming from the Spanish version of sending Mr. Beast play button into space. This is how crazy the analytics look. You can see that the video has been live on the channel for well over 100 days, but it wasn't until day 126 that it went from 90,000 views to one. 1.3 million views in the space of a week. And look, the retention's actually not too bad. The audience are all the right countries instead of just English speakers like UK and USA. And it isn't just this video that's doing well because it's kind of trickled into the others. You can see I've got half a million views now on this play button video, even though it came out over a year ago. So straight away, I reached back out to the Spanish team and we are now uploading videos once again. You can see the first one came out four days ago. It's doing really well. I honestly have no idea what's going to happen. I don't know if this is just going to keep up because so far the views are increasing each day. But now that this is happening, the audio tracks feature on Jack Sucks at Life, that is being pushed to the side so that I can focus on this because this is my opportunity to actually break even on this channel. Oh my God. That was a lot of analytics talking. I'm sorry, I'm just very excited about it. But anyway, we are back on r slash Jack Sucks at Life. And we have 161,000 members. And you know what? We could probably get to 162,000 by next week. Join the Reddit, please. Top post of the week. Which video is better? The Sending Mr. Beast play button into space English version or Jack sucks at life dances around a bit then humps a plan. <laughs> Oh man, I miss titling the no context videos. It was so fun to type them all in once a week, but Galvin does a great job now, so I don't need to. Kong Charles the Third. Weird that you went with Kong Charles instead of King Kong. I mean, King Kong's a thing already, guys. That's a better pun in my opinion. Idiots. Jack gave me a terrible pickup line last video, but she actually said yes. Was that my banana one? <laughs> This man is insane with the ladies. You've got to give me some advice. Hey, it was my pickup line. Don't give him credit. I just hope you actually do have a big banana or you're in trouble. Jack could use this to learn the seasons. Me in spring, me in summer, me in fall, me in winter. These aren't even particularly good pictures to demonstrate summer and spring. That looks nothing like spring. It's all grey and my hair's wet. And this one doesn't even have any sun or anything in it. Look, I typed in Jack Sucks at Life Sun and this came right up. That's perfect. You should have used that, idiot. Oh my god. What is that? I don't like that at all. Could we not? Jack, can you bring Flossy or Kong in this week's Reddit video? Yeah, well, I could, but they're both asleep right now. And if I wake them up, I'll then have to let them out for a week, because otherwise they'll pee on the carpet. I'll tell you what, Editor Kai, just put my face on top of this old screenshot. There we go. Woo, good girl, Flossy. Good boy, Kong. Mama looking the right way, I hope so. When did this happen? <laughs> so that was four days ago, right? And the Spanish video had 500,000 views. Now, four days later, it's on 1.3 million. It's growing fast faster than the original video did. Like, it could potentially get more views than the original. That is not impossible right now, which is mental to think about. It just started blowing up. Now it's at 600k, 700k, 750, 800,000, 3.5 million now. I think this guy got confused. <laughs> How would you defend yourself if Jack broke into your house? <laughs> right, we're getting creative with the questions. We're really at the bottom of the barrel. Show him a plant. Great distraction. <laughs> Jack when he sees a plant. Guys, can we? It was one time, all right? I like plants in a totally normal manner now. I have a real plant here that he's like been around for a year and a half. He's doing great. Look, he's 
got a little pop-up pirate. Oh, I've lost it! Got a little pop-up pirate sword just for cosmetic purposes. That's nice. And then there's even a little cardboard chameleon that Becky got me. That's nice, isn't it? Jack should make a YouTube channel and give us the password and see what we do in 24 hours. Um, how would that work? Because it does sound like a funny idea. But surely just the first person that gets access to it just retains access because they immediately change the password. And then if it ended up in the wrong person's hands, then maybe they do something dodgy with it that's just, like, not funny. It'd be spammed with not safe for work stuff, huge security risk, password we changed. Yeah, potentially that would happen, but potentially it wouldn't. But it depends who got it, wouldn't it? If I could give control of the account to, like, a thousand people rather than just the first person that got it, then it would probably work better. But, uh, yeah, it's probably not gonna work, is it? If you got any similar ideas, though, let me know, because it would be fun to try something, like, along that line. So someone commented, Jack is never going to run out of titles, and then just a month later. <laughs> Sorry, guys, can't think of a good title for this one. That reminds me that I was meant to use an auto-generated thumbnail for the Reddit video last week, and then I was gonna do it for this week, but I've already got the Spanish channel title. The auto-generated thumbnail idea will happen as soon as I don't have a better title to shove in instead. <laughs> if Jack was to get arrested, what would it be for? 200 comments, here we go. Robbing Tommy in it for his play buttons. Oh, it would be a good video, to be fair. Owning a high-tech gaming computer, playing once, then never again. <laughs> Did you not see me playing with the rocks on Neil.fun? Tommy thinking he has the most channels. I literally have 16. I could make that 17. Shut up, Jack sucks at wigs. Your time is gone. Since Jack wanted more flossy posts, I made a flossy pillar. That's awful. Thank you. I remade Jack's thumbnail because I thought he didn't put effort into it. All right, a bit rude. <laughs> I thought it did the job. I thought that worked well. That looks good enough, right, doesn't it? Well, let's see. Let's see your better version. Okay, that's your better version. And you've done like a slightly less contrasted version. Okay, I mean, they don't compare nicely because they're different shapes and sizes. I genuinely prefer mine, though. I don't know why. I think it's just easier to see what it is, but yours is still good. Let's see what the comments said. I'm sure everyone else thinks yours is better. This post is very high degree of quality for the standard of the sub. I'm impressed how good your redesign looks. Okay, well, they liked it. He put no effort in at all. He has it. <laughs> That's an amazing thumbnail. Jack should make that the thumbnail. It is a lot better. Your thumbnail clearly looks better. However, I don't think it matches his style of thumbnails. Well, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it is better, but it's just because it's cropped by badly. That's what it is. You've made mine look way worse because it's all small and cropped. 1 million, we need to see analytics, Jack. Well, hopefully you enjoyed the beginning of this video, but also you may have noticed I hid the earnings, and that is because I want to let this unfold for a few months, kind of see exactly what's going to happen, and then make a main channel analytics video out of it, where I reveal if the channel's actually made a profit. Because over the last 18 months, I think on that channel, I've probably spent like... £8,000. So that's a lot of money I need to get back. <laughs> so hopefully this video gets to like 20 million. My brother has a double hair whorl. <laughs> Well, as irrelevant as that is, it's quite cool, to be fair. I'm not even mad. Some regional differences. UK, US. Okay, so you're saying that I look like Scott the Woz, but in actual reality, it's just another white guy with brown hair and glasses. Our actual features aren't really that similar, other than, like, we both have teeth because we're humans, you know what I mean? Who wore it better? Where have you got that picture of me from? This is, like, six years old. Okay. Ah, yeah. Flossie in the lovely sunglasses. Ah, Flossie wins hands down. Jack is in Family Guy. I bet this will be really good. I want a chainsaw! I was not disappointed. It's official, guys. Jack likes me. Pineapple Why? on pizza? I like pineapple on pizza. Ah, it's your Reddit name! <laughs> One thing you like about Jack. Oh, look at that. That's when I had 2 million subscribers. <laughs> 2 million? More like... To three million, because that's that's how many I've got now. Well, let's see all the amazing things that people like about me. I don't know why I like him. I've been watching since I got trolling days, and he stayed my fave YouTuber since. I'm just so invested in the community. It's because of my just natural oozing charisma, of course. That's why. I genuinely think his glasses fit his face really well. It's weird to watch old videos without his glasses nowadays. Do you know what? I'm inclined to agree with you. I mean, I look at myself in the reflection from what I can see anyway. My face looks weird. It's like, why is your eye so small? It's like when Arthur... T <laughs> Has anyone seen when Arthur from Arthur takes his glasses off? So this is Arthur normally, and then this is him with no glasses, and that's kind of how I feel about my own face now. 
<laughs> if Jack could collab with any YouTuber, who would you want it to be? There's me with Skeppy. Hey, me and Skeppy have collabed before. The year was 2019. I've got his gold play button right there to prove it. Actually, we did a load of videos together. We, like, made diss tracks on each other and stuff. Top collab you want from me is TurdBoy420. Oh, I can dream. Dan TDM. I honestly don't know why, but it would be interesting. Dan's got a nice little play button collection, and it would be cool to, like, do a little video getting a tour of it or something. That'd be nice. Mr. Beast. Yeah, I've done two collabs with Mr. Beast. One where he gave me $100,000, but I've still never once spoken to him out loud. So that's got to happen one day, surely. Jack and SP737. We've done videos together as well. Minecraft Speedrunner versus Two Hunters featuring Jack Sucks Alive. Yes! Which do you think Jack would choose? Get rid of the PewDiePie play button or get rid of the OG gold play button? I would obviously get rid of the gold play button. I love that thing. It's absolutely beautiful. But it's not PewDiePie's 100 million play button, is it? Literally, arguably the most famous play button in existence. Reminder for the no context in salute. Oh, no! Okay, which one haven't I seen yet? I bet that hurt. Go on then. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Jack wants to go to the towns with the weirdest names, and here are some that I have found. You've not found that. That's screenshots from Google Images. I kind of have second thoughts on the, like, visiting funny place names video, because, like, is it that interesting, really? Would it be good? I don't know. I can't quite work it out. But that being said, one day after this video comes out, I am actually leaving this room, and I'm filming a video in a cool location, and I'm really excited about it, and then that should hopefully provide, and everything goes well, that'll be the next video on Jack Sucks Alive, and it is nothing like the usual videos that I do, so I'm hyped about it. I'm sure it'll get no views, but I'll enjoy it. <laughs> made this turd boy guy. Oh, you've made the turd boy Reddit thing. Oh, it's so cute. Petition for Jack to do a Neil.fun interlude. Absolutely not, because then I'll run out of Neil.fun videos. Glad you're enjoying those, by the way. When was the last one? Oh, it's this fella. Look at that. Draw a perfect circle. 300,000 views. I'll take it. Whoa, look at that horrible, disgusting thumbnail as well. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Jack, please, if I ever get the two million, remind me to do a garage tour. Hey, I said two million on Jack sucks at stuff. You're not getting me that easy. If you want to see a garage tour for some reason, even though my garage is really small and there's nothing in it at all, then subscribe to this channel right now. I have realised I've actually been forgetting to ask people to subscribe, so subscribe to Jack sucks at stuff, please. Thank you. Jack, can you say it's my birthday on the 22nd? Hmm, well, I could, but... A bit early, really, isn't it? Yeah, we'll leave it for now. Another promise Jack Sucks at Life is probably never going to do. Oh, you've dug this one from the depths. All right, what is Petition it? for Jack to play Hatterful Boyfriend so he can find his pigeon mate. <laughs> now, I did see... <laughs> now, I did see this post earlier in the week, and I was well up for the idea. But when I look at it on Steam, it's not the most PG thing I've ever seen. So I feel it really could be a bad idea. But you know what? 15,000 likes on this video. And oh, I will okay, play then. this. Let's see how many it's on. Mm, okay. Go on. Show us. You'll get there. 16,000. Well, I guess that means I have to play the pigeon dating simulator game. Oh, wait, I already did like four years ago. What's that? Jack plays a pigeon dating simulator. And if I remember correctly, I wore my pigeon mask the entire time. Do your research. I keep to my promises, all right? Most of them, anyway. Jack, you can change short thumbnails now. Ah, oh, is it just a mobile thing? Every single shot I've ever released, I've done it on the computer, and you can't change the thumbnails on the computer yet. So I guess for the time being, that means I'm stuck with monstrosities like this. 190,000 people have subscribed to Don't Subscribe after the challenge ended. That's a whole silver play button. Yeah, a whole silver play button and an extra $19,000 if I was going to be given that. That's kind of mad, you know, isn't it? What a crazy series. How did that even happen? Guys, we found the revolutionary group. Oh. Oh my god, why does the Jackapilla have its own subreddit? There's a hundred members and it's legit just Jackapilla related posts. <laughs> Okay, all future Jackapilla posts can go on there from now on, and I never have to look at a single one ever again. Jack went choosing words. Enhance or zoom, Jack. <laughs> Damn, Jack sucks at Espanol. Really about to pull a Jack sucks trophy and skyrocket. Ah, oh, what an exciting time that was. Look at it gaining on, on Jack sucks's stuff. Look how fast I'm going. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. You underestimate my power. <laughs> Don't try it. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> 
I will be honest with you, videos for a Latin American audience make far less per thousand views than video for an English speaking audience just because Latin America is a lot worse off financially so advertisers aren't spending as much. But to be honest, I'm not that bothered about the money. I'm just excited about the analytics. Jack added a Russian dub. Oh yeah, that's right. So I've not given up on the audio tracks on Jack Sucks at Life. We're just doing the Spanish channel as well at the same time while it's doing stuff. But yeah, if we head over to this video, 200 million subscribers. I'm chatting away in English. Big, Hold on a second. Mr. Beast back on now I'm chatting in Spanish. Hold on a second. Now I'm chatting in Russian. I have a Russian voice. How unreal is that? 50 million подписчиков, которые выглядят более традиционно как трофей. We got global. I got. I'll show the analytics. So 43 million people have watched in English, but in Spanish in the last 28 days there's been 30,000, which you know that's a start. And you can see the graph is going the right way as well. 4,000 Spanish speaking listeners yesterday. And then the Russian obviously has just been added, but it is currently on 197 views, which I am happy with because like these eight views here, that's us testing it. But then the next day, 189. So it shows that YouTube is consciously making an effort to push this and hopefully it'll just keep going. By the way, I understand that it perhaps isn't logical for Jack Sucks at Espanol and Jack Sucks at Live audio tracks to both be uploading the same kind of videos at the same time because they're kind of maybe effectively competing against each other. But I'm just seeing what happens, to be honest. I cannot ignore what is happening on Jack Sucks at Espanol, so I've got to keep whacking videos on there because currently that's having far more short-term success, so it's worth just exploring both options and seeing what happens. Hey Jack, is this piece of the fake play button still on the door? Yes, it is. Jack, after seeing all of the things that Mojang has added to Minecraft. <laughs> yeah, when I eventually play again, I wonder how different it'll feel. Because when I like watch one of my friends videos, because obviously I know lots of people that play Minecraft, I notice things like the iron ore looks different. And I'm like, what's that about? Wait, what? <laughs> Why is this here? I was so confused for a second. This is Blizzard Lava's post from two years ago with the 100 million award. It looks like we've gotten to the bottom of the post. So the Reddit's just showing me the top posts of all time. <laughs> Well, I guess that means we well and truly have reached the end of this week's Reddit video. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.